All right, we have this interesting deal. So we got one, two, three, two. Two seven, two ember, two four six seven, two ember, seven white tail, LCD failure. So when they do a LCD test, screen test, or computer test, everything is good. So the technician said when they shut the computer down and turn it back on, so when they turn it off, disconnect the battery, reconnect the battery, the computer works fine until you shut it down again, turn it back on again, same issue persists. Okay. P151G001. Wouldn't this have warranty? Why is it even here? It's already been opened by another tech. So let's check the service tag number. See what we find. It's over one, it's already over. Warranty is gone by more than a year. Hmm. Familiar Type C port that I hate. Okay. So this is the LCD connector. Okay. So the tech focused on the battery. So they worked on the battery connector. Okay, so if you repeat what they said, let's see what happens. Disconnect. There is no CMOS battery. That can, that's loose. That should be like that. Okay. Okay. So this should work fine then, as per their description. So it will work fine now. Apparently. So now we're waiting for it to finish its self test.
Look at all these hands. Look at all these rubbish. So they all get in your hand if you don't use gloves. Well, it's the same error code. We didn't get that issue that they were saying they were getting. All right, let's. Um, I've disconnected the battery completely. Press the power button for some time. Okay. This guy has no USB port. Everything Type C. I wonder when we're gonna get Type C keyboards. Maybe they're already out for the high end with the big, a lot of LEDs on them. Who knows? So I'm not able to repeat the problem they're complaining about. <sighs> like they told me that they can turn the computer on. I don't see that happening. Connection there looks good. And interesting enough, I do have a screw has fallen out, by the way. That's interesting. I do have this screen with a cracked screen. Just swapped one out yesterday.
Okay, so this screen is a working screen, just has a crack on it. So technically, this should turn it on. While that's going on, I'll just inspect the cable itself, the flex cable that is. So there one says OLED and whatnot. Let's see. We're fixing it by waiting. Incredible. Okay. Oh, sorry, it could already be up because it's got a crack. Yes. Hmm. Is that the login screen? Yeah, definitely a screen issue. So we get no error messages on this one. Oh, yeah, okay, we can disconnect that. I was thinking I disconnected the screen without disconnecting the battery. So the boy for OLED, when OLED fails, you may know that you don't see anything on the screen. It's like the entire panel doesn't show much. And I don't know if they already touched the LCD connection on this. Or I wonder if the LCD cable itself is damaged. The ribbon cable maybe has some kind of bend or something, who knows. But something's definitely not right. And just in case, we'll rub some alcohol.
Okay. Power button. Hold. Hold. Yep, keyboard backlight is on. Yeah, error code. Okay, just need a new screen, mate. Okay, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.